Good sight! What's going on guys, we're back. Christmas break is over, officially, and time to get back to work. Um, sorry about the wet hair, but I just had an extremely vegan shower. More on that later. Today though, we're talking about tinnitus. Now what is tinnitus? Uh, if you've never heard of it, um, it's basically it's like a ringing, a buzzing, or like a whirring sound in your ear. And it just kind of persists through everything. In some people it stops after 20 minutes, some people it stops after a few hours, some people it doesn't stop at all. Now when I had it, it was chronic tinnitus, which means it didn't stop at all. It was pretty much non-stop ringing 24 seven, at least at some level, uh, whether that be a little lower at some points in the day, especially at night, um, but it would be a little bit quieter in the day, especially in the afternoon um, when you're kind of more active, I guess, right? So anyway, how many people are affected by tinnitus? Well, that's a good question. About 50 million Americans, last time I checked anyway, that could be higher now. That's about 15% of the population. So about 15% of people um, have at least some form of tinnitus, whether that be, you know, short term, medium term, long term, like chronic, whatever. Okay, so the question is, so how did I cure my tinnitus? Let's find out. That's right, this was my secret weapon against tinnitus. Now, I'm not necessarily saying to cut out dairy because I'm trying to push my vegan agenda. Actually, at the time, I had no idea that this had anything to do with even getting rid of my tinnitus. I was cutting dairy out for dietary reasons because I was trying to lose some weight. But what ended up happening is the tinnitus, the tinnitus actually went away after about about a week off of dairy. It wasn't very long at all, so pretty good. I had amazing results. If you guys have had similar results uh, with dairy or with something else, because I know other people have other things work for them, but put it in the comments down below, especially because if somebody's watching this and they're looking for help, the comments down below might be able to help them a little bit more than even I can, because I'm only given one. I'll, I'll name a few other things that can help with it, but right now I'm focusing on the one, which is diet. I'd cut out the dairy products, all right? Cut out the cheese, cut out the milk. You're not a cow, I know. <laughs> it sounds weird to say, but it's the truth. And as soon as I cut that stuff out, ringing into the ear is gone. Now, another thing you do wanna cut out though, because a, a friend of mine was actually looking into this, aspartame. Aspartame is that low calorie sweetener, or no calorie sweetener, whatever it is. It's actually bacteria poop is what it is. Um, which people drink in their soda. Anyway, now when I cut that out, I actually still consume diet soda even after going vegan or cutting out the dairy. So that didn't actually get rid of the tinnitus for me, or it didn't affect my tinnitus because I still consumed that even after I'd gotten rid of it. But it does help a lot of people from what I've seen. Now, when I cut out aspartame, I did get rid of my chronic headaches. So that was one positive benefit of that. So I'm certainly Certainly for cutting out both aspartame and dairy, of course, um, but whatever works for you. Other things that could work on that, and I've got a little list here, let me see. So stress management, I mean, you gotta you know, meditate, do whatever you gotta do for stress management. Exercise, um, running, any kind of cardio, anything like that, but just exercise in general, getting your blood flowing is gonna help with the tinnitus. Um, a lot of people actually think that tinnitus is caused or at least partially caused by the um, arteries in your ear, or the um, blood vessels in your ear actually being clogged with saturated fat and cholesterol. So, you know, switching to a plant-based diet is gonna help with that as well. It's gonna cut back on that. Let the blood flow a little bit easier to your ears, let you hear better, um, stuff like that. Those are benefits of the, the plant-based diet that don't really get talked about very much. But anyway, another one, <clears throat> excuse me, avoid alcohol before bed. Avoiding alcohol before bed if you do this, you're gonna wake up in the morning with the ringing in your ears, hangover, whatever it is you wanna call it, brings the tinnitus on if you're a person that is affected by it or somebody who suffers with it. It's, a, it's an easy way to bring it on, uh, bring on an episode anyway, you don't wanna do that. So alcohol at night, cut that out. Um, but yeah, that's about it. But if you guys have other ones that have worked for you or worked for other people, put it in the comments down below. That's gonna do it for today, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Uh, shout out to Gina. She's the one who I'm doing this video for. She had some questions about this. So uh, that's it. Till next time, guys. Till tomorrow. I'm getting a haircut this weekend. So vote for what you want in the haircut, I guess, in the comments down below as well. Till tomorrow, guys. Take care.